China's new construction projects around the world have already created quite a stir because China has created some infrastructure that other countries can never imagine. You may already know how far ahead China is in mega project work. In today's video, we will see what exactly China is planning to cut 700 mountains, starting from a futuristic city in the desert. So let's begin. Desert Mega Project. A huge mega project has been undertaken to generate renewable energy in the deserts of northern China. The mega project has already started generating electricity using solar panels and turbines. The first phase of the project is expected to include a number of solar panels and turbines capable of generating 100 gigawatts of electricity next year. Meanwhile, the second phase of 450 GW power generation work has also started. The second phase is estimated to cost more than 3 trillion yen. The electricity produced used in the mega project will be supplied to various densely populated cities in northern China through high cables. The Chinese government has announced it to undertake 13 more such mega projects in the future, through which China's electricity demand can be largely met with renewable energy. Hong Kong International Center it is currently a skyscraper construction in China, and the height of this building will be 700 meters. This skyscraper is currently going to be the tallest building in China, although the 632 meters high Shanghai Tower, which is currently the second tallest building in the world, just behind the Burj Al Khalifa in Dubai. The aim of this new skyscraper complex is to achieve platinum certification. This is only given to large buildings that are very environmentally friendly. Keeping this in mind, some open spaces have been designed for ventilation on the east and northeast sides of the tower to ensure natural ventilation throughout the building. Also, high-performance glass has been used to reduce heat gain and allow plenty of natural light to flow into the tower, which at the same time enhances the aesthetic beauty of the tower. Tencent Gaming's future stick city. China is going to build a stick city in the future equal to Manhattan. That will be habitable for about 80,000 people. The city will have office buildings, residential areas, parks, shopping complexes, entertainment areas, and many other facilities. The name of the city is Net City, which has been developed by Tencent Gaming Company. Yes, the city will be developed by Tencent maker of Riot Games, PUBG, and Wetchit. It will cost around $22 billion to build this city. Earlier, Tencent worked on some such extraordinary mega-projects. And one of them is the Tencent Seafront Tower, which cost $599 million to build. Net City will be fully eco-friendly, along with abundant vegetation. It will also use solar power, which is expected to reduce living costs. Monorail Bridge. It is the longest spiral monorail bridge in the world, which is basically known as the world's fastest high-speed rail. The length of the railway of this monorail bridge is about 4,200 meters. The structure of the bridge is mainly made of steel, making the shape of this bridge more massive. The most interesting part of this bridge is that its main structure looks like the orbit of the solar system. The bridge is basically three panels, and these panels look like orbits. The length of the slopes of these 60-meter wide orbits is 720 meters. Also, each column of the bridge is about 40 meters long. The infrastructure of this bridge is so innovative that the thrill of traveling here is like a roller coaster. It is one of the most attractive railway bridges in the world. Solar Panel Expressway Kilu Transportation Development Group has been developing a unique project of Solar Panel Expressway for several years. Its first project, the Solar Panel Highway, was completed in Jinan, Shandong Province in September 2016, and took 10 months to build. And then the second was completed in December 2017, which was a 1.6 kilometers long expressway solar panel. The road shown on the screen here is one of the world's first solar highways. These roads are basically made with three layers. The first is an innovative material known as ordinary concrete. The middle layer is the solar panel, and the final layer is an insulating material that protects the panels from damp soil. One of the most important features of this type of road is that it can charge electric cars. So the roads are also designed in such a way that large vehicles like medium-sized trucks can move over them very easily. Yeah. 
Lanzhou New Area Project. About one-fifth of China's population lives in the mountains, but the rate at which the population is growing has created a shortage of land for development. However, according to some local officials, if the mountains are cut and the plains are made, selling them will bring in billions of yuan and reduce the pressure on the agricultural land. Some of China's biggest construction companies are spending 2.2 billion pounds to level about 700 hills. It is the largest moving mountain project in history so far. A whole new area is planned to create some new buildings to live there, for which about 700 hills will be destroyed. As these projects are not environmentally friendly, they become the subject of discussion. The spokesperson of the project, An Jing Ong, denied it completely. However, it is feared that this project in the city of Lan's house will increase soil erosion from 10% to 59% due to the concentration of airborne dust particles. But to understand how much it will actually harm the environment, we will have to wait for more time. If you like the video, you can like it, and if you want to see more interesting videos like this, then subscribe to the channel now and click on the bell icon next to it. See you in the next episode. Till then, stay well.